Hi guys, so welcome to the 11th program of the DevOps. In this, uh, we will be creating the pipeline releases. So first, what you will have to do is go to your account, uh, go to the uh, your organizations, my Azure DevOps organizations. Click on the organization for which you have got the public, uh, um, like oh, the access to the public. Uh, network or the public uh, organization setting in via the form uh, go into that create a new project after creating a new project you will see the screen something like this so once you are here first uh, go to the organization settings all the way down the uh, screen as you can see here after going to the organization settings, scroll down and go to pipeline releases. So on the left side, you can see these things in that pipelines and in pipelines, uh, go to the settings of pipelines. So then after you go to pipeline settings, scroll down, you'll see something like a uh, disable creation of uh, classic release pipelines this should be in off mode it will be uh, in uh, enabled in the beginning disable it now go back to the organization once you are back in the organization you will have the created project here I refer to the previous program on how to create a project for this once you are here now click on the project you will see something like this and go to pipelines releases in releases you will see something like this so give a new release new release pipeline now you will see something like this now click on empty job and click on uh, don't do anything here just click on the into button after this is done now you will be adding the artifacts once it is there for the source click on this and you will get the source here this source is your github's uh, folder this this folder should be in your github the folder of this should be in the github the first thing is uh, github username and the next one is the folder name now after uh, doing this you just scroll down and you will see uh, something like add so add it after adding it go to the job and task click on it you will see something like agent job click on add agent job you will get a list of agents search for maven you will get two things add the maven after adding on maven click on it you will have something this the task version should be as one after uh, keeping that scroll down and see if uh, everything is unchecked you don't have to change anything here for the for the program uh, first save it you don't have to save too but uh, it's better to save then go to the maven pom file once you are here, you will see the source uh, or the file directory of wherever your pom.xml file is there. Go to that uh, place and cop click on the pom.xml file. As you can see the intent program pom.xml file and click on OK. Now this uh, should be correct and then save on it. The path to this pom.xml file should be correct. Please see to that. After it is done, you can just create the uh, release pipeline. Now once you go to all pipelines, you will see that the uh, newly released pipeline 2 is here. Click on it and you will see something like this. Click on the stage 1 and it should be running uh just wait until it shows that the pipeline has been released successfully it will take a little time 
if you have not specified the path of pum.xml file in the github it will give you an error here please see that the github file and repository are properly connected refer to the previous programs or the manuals of your respective colleges release of pipeline may take a little time once this is done our program will be completed so as you can see that this deployment has been succeeded and you can see everything is having green creek marks so yeah this is what we have to get at the last this is the end of 11th program thank you for your patience and your attention thank you all